apparently I need to go to the smelling shack because I do not like all this mess behind me. I think it's a mess. You guys probably think it's interesting. You know, sliding door hardware, body oils, remote covers, keychains. I think it looks messy, but that's just where it is and this is where I sit. Hey everybody, this is Anna with Adventures with Anna and I'm lighting me some incense. This is a super hit cone incense, something that we sell here in the shop. Um, I've been having trouble keeping it burning, so I've been experimenting with it, trying to see if I can figure out why it's not cooperating like it's supposed to. Here we go, that should burn just fine now. Stick it back here in my little burner. Put the top on. Anyway, I wanted to tell you guys that, you know, you've seen my darn good yarn squishy package and I did my package review and everything. Well, I actually made up the pattern that they recommended for the sari yarn that I got. It took me maybe two hours with interruptions to make this. It was a lot of fun to make this and I really liked the outcome. Pardon me. The pattern that came with the subscription this month was for a bowl. Now I know I got a tail in here. I need to finish weaving it in, but I made this bowl. It looks really cool. This was the whole ball of yarn that they sent. So with that said, and I don't think it made it all the way around. I know it didn't make it all the way around, but anyway, with that said, uh, this yarn is absolutely wonderful. It was interesting and challenging to learn to work with for the very first time because I'd never worked with anything like this before. It was Most of it was in strips, maybe half an inch or three quarter of an inch wide. My only complaint about it going along is that the um, silk would string off like this and I'd have big old wads of silk strings that I had to cut off and, and pull off and stuff. That wasn't that big of a deal. But sometimes it got a little annoying as I was crocheting around. And this is, I love it, I do. It doesn't smell like roses anymore though. That rose smell is gone, unfortunately. But I thought this would be cute to put in my future craft room to maybe put balls of yarn in or another idea for something like this apples oranges bananas put fruit in it so the pattern was really simple the yarn was amazing to work with even though it was expensive yarn uh, retails for about eighty dollars for the same size ball that i got but yeah anyway and like i mentioned the other day with my review uh, darn good yarn is a fair trade, not free, ta free trade like I said, but they are a fair trade organization, which means the ladies that actually recycled the sari got paid a fair wage for what they were doing. I appreciate that. I sell some of those type of products in my own store here. Um, not everything we sell is fair trade, but we do sell a lot of fair trade items as well, what we think we can sell. Because a lot of your fair trade items do tend to be a little more expensive than the items that you can sell a lot cheaper, obviously. But anyway, darn good yarn. I love it. This was a wonderful subscription item. The bowl is amazing. I liked it. The pattern was super simple. And one more thing. I got a notification today that I got my gift certificate for winning the photo contest for last month's photo thing. And I just want to let you guys know that I am going to give back to you guys because I love you. And I ordered some things with my gift card that I am going to use for a giveaway on this channel. Now that it should take about two weeks to get my stuff. Hopefully it's sooner than that, but they said up to two weeks. 
Once I get it and look at it and decide what I want to keep for myself and what I would like to give away, I will let you know and I will announce the giveaway. So be watching for that. And if you don't want to miss that opportunity, make sure you subscribe to my channel. And if you want to get extra notification, click that little bell so that you will receive a notification every time I post a video. Now I realize this week, this is the third video in a row that I have posted, but there's a lot of things going on. And I have a feeling that I'm going to be posting more videos than just my normal Monday yarn videos. So hopefully I don't like wear you guys wear out my welcome on your screens because I would like to be a part of your screen every now and then. So anyway, that's just that's just silly. I'm going to let you go for now and I noticed I had a few new subscribers and I want to thank them for subscribing and leave me a comment below if you have any questions or anything for me. Um, I'd be happy to try to answer those and I will see you in the next video.